In this video, we're going to take a look at your Google Drive interface. You can see that I've already logged into Google.com, and in the black navigation bar, I've already clicked on Drive, which is taking me to my Drive list. We're going to take a look at how your drive is set up. You'll notice right off the top, at the top of the screen, is a search bar. You can search for any um, word, a title of a document, anything that you might think a document contains, you can search for it right through this bar. If you click on this arrow, you can refine your search by searching for specific types of documents or by um, documents that are by Norfolk Public Schools. Um, so a lot of search options you have for finding documents in your, do in your drive. Over here on the left hand side is your navigation pane. This is where you're going to be able to do things in Drive and where you're going to organize your Drive list. You'll see a create button which will allow you to create documents and upload but button which will allow you to upload uh, other files, so Word or PowerPoint or Excel files, um, and be able to use them in Google Drive. Um, you'll see my Drive and if you click on the arrow next to that, if you have any folders created, you will see those folders, uh, that folder list expand. You can also look for documents that are shared with you. You can view your documents, just the starred documents, which are documents that you find are important. You can also view by recent documents, which would be recently edited or opened by you. Um, if you click the More button, you also can uh, view by activity, which would be the last thing that was uh, edited. You can set up offline docs if that is something that you have set up. You can look for all items. Now, a lot of times if you're having trouble finding something, if you choose all items, you might find it in that list. You also have a trash, and you can also, uh, again, search by owner type and a lot of other options that you have there. In, your, in the center here, you have your documents list. So these are all of the documents that you created or documents that were shared with you. So you can tell that based on the owner. Uh, me is everything that I've created, and then if another person's name is listed there, that means they created the document and shared it with me. You'll see all documents in here. So you'll see uh, documents, you'll see presentations, you'll see folders listed here, uh, you'll see drawings, any type of document can be listed here. And then you'll also see the date that it was last modified. Now you can choose to sort this documents list in a variety of ways. If I click on the sort button here, you can see I can sort based on the document that was last edited by me or the document that was last modified. Now this is good if you have a lot of shared documents. Last modified means that anybody who modifies the document, um, it will show up in your documents list. You can also sort by last open by you. You can sort by title. Now by default, your documents list is sorted by title. And what that does is that pops all of your folders to the top of the list. And then you have to scroll down to find any documents that are not sorted in, in folders and then um, based on the quota used. And this is for documents that you upload, not documents that you create in Google Docs. I generally have my list sorted by last modified. Um, I like that version the best. Uh, I would suggest that you kind of try these out maybe each for a day or two and see which one you like the best. You can sort your documents based on a list or a new feature to Google Drive is you can actually sort your documents and view them as a picture. So if I click switch to grid, it's going to show me a little picture of what each of the documents is. Now if it's a folder, it's just going to show you the picture of the folder. But otherwise, it's going to show you a picture of what those documents look like. And if I actually um, click into a folder here, maybe it'll be easier to see. Now I have a variety of documents and I can see without even open the doc, opening the document, what the document contains. So that, if you're a visual person, that grid view might be just what you're looking for. I prefer to work in the list view. And then your settings are also located over here. Um, you can change how the uh, display, how dense the display is. Um, you can see I have a compact display going on. Here are some of your um, overall drive settings, your upload settings. You can manage any apps that you might have installed. You can take a look at keyboard shortcuts, and you can view uh, help for Google Drive. So that, exp so that is a brief overview of your Google Drive uh, dashboard and how that is organized and how you can change the organization of it.